Hi, my name is John. I'm the owner of Bear Paul Wilderness Designs. I want to show you another one of my tent combinations here. This right here is a Canopy 2. It's one of my Canopy tents. You can also get in the Canopy 1. But I, you notice I already got it set up. What I'm going to do today is show you how to set up an inner tent inside like a Canopy tent. And what I've done here is I have a, a net 1.5 um, tent to go inside it. And it's going to hang from the top and also go out to the stakes. Now I got this tent set up about so about six or seven inches above the ground which is about normal for a tent like this. This tent also has the uh, zipper vestibule with a three-quarters vestibule instead all the way down but it shows you um, but what I'm going to do is show you how to put this inner tent inside and what it looks like inside. Now this inner tent in here is a 1.5 man tent. It's a little bit bigger than a solo tent and smaller than a two-man tent. That's what the person ordered. It also has the Cuban along the sides and the Cuban floor. Normally comes with a seal nylon floor. But this will show you a good idea of what it looks like inside. First off, just for so you can see it better, I want to take I want to fold back part of the, vet, the entire vestibule area. Normally this tent, it hangs from the two, there's two loops at the top up here, two peaks. It's going to hang from those and it's going to go out to the four stakes. So what I'm going to do first is I want to hang it from the rear and then stake and hang the front and stake it out. You notice I already got the lines ran to the outside because I, once it's once it's up, I go from the outside and easily um, attach the um, um, the corner stakes to it. Now the tent has line locks inside, so I can hang it and then um, pull it tight really quick. There, once I got it hung hung like that, I'm going to go and do the sides really quick. Now, you can see the tin inside. It's hanging from the top up here and the butt back, and it's pulled to the side. You can also stake out the corners if you like, but it's normally not, it's normally not needed. Now, there's also loops on the canopy tent. There's loops right here at the side. You could connect to there if you'd like, and I can easily do that just clip it to that if I want to do that, if I want to raise it higher or whatever. But sometimes it's usually just easy to just go out to the stakes out here and it works perfect. So I'll show you a little bit more what it looks like inside. You can see this one has a lot of room inside. You can also get like a knit two in here and um, it, it go out about another uh, six inches on each side. And it's staked out to the corners out here. And you can see there's quite a bit of room still above the tent, so it's, it's no problem um, lowering the tent or raising the tent. Well, thank you for watching. Check us out on our website. We have other designs. This was a custom net tent, net 1.5 that went inside. We do other customs. We do pretty much what anybody wants. They, people email with their, ad, uh, their ideas all the time, and we try to come up with a solution for them. Well, thank you for watching.